Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. They say that the jungle never sleeps. In addition to all the exquisite wildlife, they are also filled with some of the predators you would definitely not want to run into. So, here we have a list of some of the nightmarish creatures you will see in the jungle. Run or ask for help. Goliath Bird Eater From a mouse to a possum and a bird to a lizard, there is nothing in the jungle safe from this spider. It's an ambush predator, which means that it waits for the perfect opportunity for the prey to cross its path so that it can attack. The way it engulfs its prey is a true horror story. First, it strikes and paralyzes its prey. Once the prey gets paralyzed and no longer resists, the Goliath Bird Eater then liquefies the inside organs of the prey and sips it like a juicy mush. Sounds gruesome, right? But I assure you, it is more gruesome when experienced. Just look at how mercilessly it's engulfing all of its prey. Vampire Bats The nights in the jungles of South America and Central America are filled with the danger of bats sucking your juicy vital fluid. That's why the name vampire is synonymous with them. Like all the other bats, they are nocturnal and hunt at night when most of the other animals in the jungle tend to sleep. Look at this poor cow and the pig who became their nightly cocktail dose. These bats mostly go unnoticed due to their razor sharp teeth and cuts through the skin as they don't cause any pain. If they don't get their blood supply two nights in a row, they could expire. Yeah, it's that important. Green Anaconda. This boa constrictor is world famous due to it being the heaviest and longest of their species. Its cousin, the reticulated python, can grow slightly greater, but the enormous girth of the green anaconda makes it almost twice as heavy. Like all constrictors, it makes use of its heavy weight and asphyxiates the prey, blocking its airways. Not only the anacondas, but their babies are also very remarkable. Instead of laying the eggs, they hatch in the mother's body, which the mother then gives birth to the live young ones. She even feasts on the unfertilized eggs and the ones that didn't make it after birth. And if they can eat their babies, you bet they can eat everything. Deathstalker Scorpion Isn't the name self-explanatory? Do I really need to say any more? Found in Africa and the Middle East, these animals are true terminators. No one in the jungle is safe from them, especially not humans. Just one sting can send you to heaven. After getting stung, you will wish to get into heaven because the sting is extremely painful and also paralyzes the body. What's crazy is that its venom is called the most expensive liquid in the world because it shows remarkable results in cancer treatment. Here, look, so many of them in one place. One step in here and you'll be deleted from life. Pus Caterpillar. Aw, doesn't this resemble a tiny fuzzy kitty cat? What a soft feathery coat. But beware, as under this fuzzy coat, a horrible piece awaits. There are sharp spikes underneath the fur, which then attach to the skin, causing a sting so painful that it radiates throughout the body, even going as deep as the bone. The pus caterpillar is called the most venomous caterpillar in the world. This evolutionary trait is to stay free of predators who would get fooled by the fuzzy top layer of skin. So always mind your cuddly nature in the wild. Pit Viper. If you ask any desert or rainforest backpacker, they will tell you that the reason behind their night terrors was the pit vipers of the region. Yes, vipers should be really feared. In the options of fight or flight, they always choose to fight. Well, I mean, why wouldn't they? Their slithering bodies are packed with enough venom to finish 30 grown men. Oh my God, look at all that venom. Their lethal fangs are their most distinguished feature. 
They fold back into the mouth when not in use, which gives them enough space to grow large. The largest ones measured somewhat near five centimeters. They also have a heat sensing organ to locate prey and will likely follow it. So if you ever spot one, ask for help. Mysterious Humanoid. This video of some bikers biking in a jungle in Indonesia stunned the whole country. As the bikers were driving their motorbikes, a humanoid figure spooked the group by coming in front of their bike. They tried to follow it, but it disappeared into the tall grass. After the video surfaced on social media, people commented on two possibilities, that either it could be a humanoid creature or a member of a lost pygmy tribe in Indonesia. Here, I can definitely say that if you see something like this, immediately get out of there. Both a secluded tribe and a humanoid creature are worth running from. Giant electric eel. This six foot long animal has something that no other water or land dwelling creature possesses, an 860 volt of current inside its body. This gigantic eel with such an electric charge can be found in no place except the infamous Amazon River Basin. If you want a plausible estimate, just know that it delivers the shock three times more than a domestic plug socket. It's even known to finish off the Amazonian caiman by electrocuting it. Look at this one hunting its meal. 500 volts was all it took, which is enough to stun an adult human. Red-bellied piranhas. I don't think that I need to warn you about the infamous red-bellied piranhas of the Amazon River Basin. What they lack in size, they make up for with their teeth. Just look how it bites through a twig so effortlessly. What a fine cut. These scavengers are an important part of the Amazon River. Although they eat figs and other ripe fruit, what they fancy the most is flesh, and their teeth help them with this. They can even pierce through steel. According to legend, the animals, which can grow about 14 inches long, have even devoured human swimmers. Just have a look at their feeding frenzy, and you will know how. Just in a few minutes, they can strip a fish to the bone. And now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is a picture of a giant Kalugo captured by some hunters in the forest. Look at its huge wingspan. What's interesting is that even with giant wings, they can't really fly. They just glide from one tree to another. This large one is unusually big. Do you think such huge ones really do exist in the jungle? The picture sure looks real to me. Poison Dart Frog. These tiny colorful frogs have a notorious reputation in the tropical forests in Central and South America. One might wonder how could these cute, cuddly little feathers be so fearsome? Well, that's because this two inch long frog is packed with enough poison to finish off 10 grown men. What's most peculiar is that the poison isn't in its mouth or internal organs, but on its very skin. Yeah, so even if you dare to touch it, you are done for. The native tribes of Colombia even use its poison on their arrows. They collect it by heating the frog near the fire so that its toxins will be released via the skin. Brazilian Wandering Spider This spider was discovered first wandering in Brazil, which gave it its name. It's an aggressive and highly venomous spider, and it even appeared in the Guinness Book of World Records 2007 for being the most venomous animal. At least 3,000 people each year get bitten by this spider, and it can even be lethal. Though native to Brazil, they get transported to other countries quite regularly in the box of bananas, which they are highly fond of. Many people mix them up with tarantulas, but they are spiders. Is anyone else feeling them ugh, crawling on your leg? Well, this man certainly is feeling that. That's it for today, guys. 
thank you so much for watching the whole video. See you next time.